Punk! Huh? Your turn. Revolution! Your turn! Now! Today we're gonna be reviewing a very, 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 very special album. Uh, Proven to Cure's debut album, Spoonful. I have to say it, I considered not even telling you when reviewing this, but that would make me a fraud. I have to tell you, this is my debut album. Proven to Cure is my project, my side project. My, you know, I'm in a band, died, and then I have my solo project, Proven to Cure, and this is Proven to Cure's debut album, so I'm going to be reviewing my own album. So let's begin. I'm going to, I promise you, I promise you I'm going to be as, object of, of, uh, as objective as possible. I've listened to it, um, imagining that it was an album released by some stranger. And what really actually kind of blew my mind when listening to it critically was this was not my intention while recording and writing it, but it kind of is the ultimate album that I can think of that is like the perfect measurement of if you like this album, I think that's a sign that you have a higher level of intelligence than the average person. And then if you don't like this album, then obviously that means the reverse, which is you're not as smart as others. So it's kind of a perfect test. It's the, the perfect the perfect test to, 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 to tell if you're smart or not is th this album, which is really not, which is really blowing my mind because I, I... So let's just get into the music. So the music is like a lo-fi indie uh, noise pop... Uh, punk, a little bit of elements of post-hardcore, kind of like, you know, what you'd expect from the guitarist of uh, post-hardcore band Died. Um, maybe like a tinge of psychedelia, uh, indie, noise pop, sort of weird, crazy kind of thing going on. I don't know. It kind of reminds me of like, like maybe if you blended together Died and car, car Seat Headrest, like pretty freaking sick combination if i'm being entirely honest like this is like something you've like never heard before fantastic emotional creative definitely the musicianship is off the freaking charts the production while lo-fi is extremely impactful lyrically it's extremely emotional dealing with all sorts of topics ranging from uh mental illness and trauma and um just uh some strange cuckoo crazy shit going on that's so beautiful and so being objective if this was an album that was not me, I honestly feel like I couldn't give it anything than on uh, higher than a 9.8 out of 10. So I'm giving it a 9.8. Obviously, I would give this a 10 if I was just trying to shove this down your throats because it's my album. But since I'm not, since I'm objective and Punk Revolution now is not trying to shill, you know, my own music because I'm not about that, I'm just gonna give it a 9.8. Definitely a Punk Revolution now album. Definitely go listen to this. Um, just definitely go listen to it. It's, it's the best album of the year so far, for sure. Uh, so, Punk Revolution Now. Good job. Proven to care for releasing a sick album. And congratulations on the album release. Everybody go donate a dollar to Proven to Care. Because Proven to Care, I really know what the hell they're doing. Because he's a grand magician. So, that's all i got to say for now. So, Punk Revolution Now. Punk Revolution Now.